What's up guys? Welcome back to Fallout. In this episode, I still haven't really decided if I want to uh, go clear out the top of the structure, maybe see if there's another way in up there, or uh, just go downstairs. These stairs look good. Let's just, let's go upstairs. Let's do this. Now, do they know we're here? They don't know we're here. Mm. There may be something good up here. Maybe. I'm not sure yet. Excuse me as I turn up my volume. There we go. Oh, he sees me. Someone even even higher up, and we're out of that. Is someone under me? That dude sounded like danger close. Maybe he's above me. Where'd that one guy go? Probably should have kept the uh, the bolt. Or not the bolt, the semi-auto. There's that guy all the way up there. Plinking. Plinking away. We're bearing, barely doing any damage to him. I'm just going to stop wasting ammo on him. There is nothing up here at all. Except some stairs to get up even higher. So far we're okay. You, dude, just like, chill out. Just chill out. It'll be alright. It'll be alright. Gonna strategically, strategically, what am, what am I trying to say? I know the word strategically, but I tried to say it in kind of a weird way, and then basically I just ended up sounding like a dumbass. Uh, so that happened. We do have a bayonet, so we do have, ooh, a bayonet stab. Is he still, like, is it just him? I think it's literally just him. I think he's the only one left. Which is probably the reason that he's super duper salty about everything. Dog meat found something. Is it bullets? What did you found? Did you find the person? I know he's up there. He's right there. Oh, I can't hit him through that. Yeah. Yeah, how do you, how do you like it? How do you like it when you're just trying to mind your own business? Oh, there's someone else. On the move. On the move. Now, is this person up here? Where? Where is this person? I don't see the red anywhere, so they must be really far away. Ooh. Come on. Come on. We can make it. What did you have? A shotgun? You were hitting me with a shotgun from this far away? Like, I'm not even mad. I'll take your chest piece, because it's modded. Bobblehead. Oh my goodness, you guys. Bobblehead. Repair bobblehead. Fusion cores permanently last 10% longer. That's for the uh, the power armor. Why go down with a ship when you can try to fix it? You know, that's the exact motto I live by when I play Battlefield with my buddies. And this guy right here, tool case. Just take all of it, please. Alright, grumpy dude. Where are you, grumpy dude? Are you the guy that like went down on the ground level and just never came back? Like, also my frame rate's tanking, which makes sense because the uh, the draw distance in this game is actually pretty solid. <laughs> now, where is where is guy down there? Can I get up there? Ah, I can. This looks amazing. Now I wonder if we can. I'm assuming we can kind of go everywhere that I can see right now, up to like the uh, kind of foggy area towards the hills, but that looks really cool. That looks really cool. It's very laggy up here. I'm gonna... we need a screenshot of this. You know, just put the, put the gun away. Alright, let's go kill somebody. <laughs> hey, buddy. S excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, I know what I wanted to say. Uh, the I think I think at the end of the last episode, I said I was going to say something this episode, and hopefully, it's uh, that someone gave me a great suggestion, and that was they said that whenever they got the game and or not whenever they got the game, but whenever they got uh, dog meat, they were going to head back to 
uh, the vault and go down in there and see about having Dogmeat look for stuff while next to the gun that was in that locker to see if maybe he could snatch it out of there or something. I think that would be really neat. Uh, that would be something I would be interested in trying, and I had also completely forgotten about that weapon, uh, so I'll probably end up going back there at some point. Maybe we'll get another lockpick level or something. I still hate the lockpicking system. Uh, that's why I enjoyed getting the screwdriver so much in Fallout 3 in my LP of that. Pork and beans, knuckles, I'll eat the pork and beans right now. An assault gas mask, that looks really cool. Yes, I'll have that, please. I will totally have that. I want to say it'll probably also look really cool with what we have going on. Uh, so this is going to give us one damage resistance and, I guess, 15 radiation resistance. Do we look fancy? Kind of. I don't know. I'm still thinking about doing the whole, like, patchwork armor. I just, I really like this armor because it's nice and, nice and lean. Did I loot all these guys? I think I did oven mitts. Well, that's probably why you lost. Because you had oven mitts. Uh, this is, okay, this is where we're, we're just going to go inside now, I guess. Excellent. Alright, now we got our dog with us. We have a little bit of ammo. I don't think we picked up any 10 mil, which sucks. Ron Perlman's hungry. Ron Perlman needs some lead. Do we have... Oh, we did get some. Oh, that's glorious. Huh? <laughs> like how can you how can you hate like just <laughs> where is this guy there now. it's what just you, you or me nothing personal I forgot to uh, hit caps lock to turn on walking you sure you saw something there's no way we're going to be able to do this quietly, so I'm just going to go ahead and start shooting, I think. I'm going to go ahead and miss because he's going to just stand up at, like, the greatest time in existence. Ow! Do I have any grenades? I think I have one fragmentation grenade. I have a mine and a grenade. Uh, we are out. Oh, no, we have. We do have Molotov cocktail. How do you guys like fire? Gee, I don't know if you heard that. That was a really weird sound. It was like a. I don't know. What the fuck was that? Metal Gear type sound? Everything. Metal Gear? I will run out of bullets at some point. That's an excellence to the... Wait, to the Commonwealth? This could be terrible, actually. I didn't want to do this. I didn't want to do this at all. I'm kind of scared right now. I'm squinting. One eye's closed. Okay. Um, I'm gonna say what happened was they all came outside with me. <laughs> like, at that moment. What the hell was that? Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, there was another one down there. Okay. I know what to do, guys. I know exactly what to do. We gotta. We're gonna try this. We're gonna. We're gonna do this. Oh man! <laughs> you guys enjoy that? I'm gonna go this way and hit this button here. I'm gonna be walking and did we win? Are we okay? There's a. Oh, it's a machine gun turret. Did we win. We won. No, stop, 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 stop. Ow, pain. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Leave me alone. Go inside quickly. <laughs> okay, we won. 
Kind of. I mean, we're hiding from a machine gun right now uh, that does a ton of damage, and all of the ammo and loot is outside with the machine gun that does a ton of damage. So they died in a, a really good spot, if I had to say. Uh, I think I should be okay to maybe eat a little bit of food instead of using another stim pack. So maybe something really good. Maybe something like a death claw steak. Gives us a little bit of agility too. That'll give us more. Uh, Nothing. At least it sure as hell looks that way. This is danger. Yeah. So, oh, there's another one down there too. This is all the turrets are ridiculous. There has to be like a console form or something. Okay, he's up here. There's got to be a console for these guys somewhere. Those are creepy guys. I just I had to. I'm not really scared so much as... No, I'm kind of scared, actually. There we go. Sweet. Short pipe bolt action rifle. Uses 30 out of 8. Alright, there we go. Um, how do we do this? Your language is atrocious, young lady. What's, just you or me. what's shooting at me? No, I didn't. <laughs> I wanted to just go. I thought I was like, press E to climb. Uh, I didn't want to go outside. I just, because he's going to come outside with me. I guess I'll poke him with a bayonet, I suppose. Um, unless there's someone else up here with a turret, and then we don't have any grenades. So I'll probably have to go down the ladder just as quick as humanly possible. jerk I don't like that at all that is like super broken that he just like the people that are aggroed onto you insta leave the cell with you that is insanely broken I wonder if that's like intentional or if you could just screw off please nope you are the dumbest thing I've ever seen <laughs> You can't fly, buddy. You can't fly. Hopefully he'll load back in with me and I'll give him a stim pack. Like... <laughs> That's a grenade. That's a grenade. That's gonna hurt really bad. Poke him. Poke him. Poke him in the head. Poke him in the... Beat him to death. Dog didn't come. Revolver. Where'd you go? Let's go. That's a Molotov. Shotgun. Wait. She's got one too. I'm gonna die now. Because fire hot. Because fire hot. Okay, they're gonna come outside with me. And then I'm gonna shoot them with a shotgun. And that's what's gonna happen. Also, these load times are insane. Like, I'm on a solid state drive. Turn around quickly. Hey, buddy. We're waiting. We're waiting for them to come up. Uh, let's have some glowing fungus. That doesn't sound delicious at all. Grilled rad roach, though. Sounds pretty good. Alright. I feel like if you shoot them while, the, while they're throwing something... This is just what I'm used to, I guess. If you shoot someone while they're throwing a grenade, like an, an NPC or something, they'll generally drop it. Uh, and also don't run off the roof anymore that's dumb it's that's not, not a good life plan okay there's a hatch with ammo this guy and another hatch and another hatch neat ah top se a carrot and a mining helmet. He snuck back here for a break. Can I just go this way? Cool. Um, I don't really want to go back in there, to be honest with you. I think what I'm going to do is go back in there, obviously, but 
Also, switch over to the bolt action rifle. Yes, the short pipe bolt action rifle. There we go. There we go. Alright, so we have 28 of these. Let's go in there now. Let's maybe try a little bit of that. This isn't the rifle. This is the rifle. Peek. Dog meat's coming from the other side. And now I'm on fire again. Why do you guys have, like... <laughs> Oh my goodness, this game is like... <laughs> I don't understand, like, there's... There's hard and then there's kind of silly. Like, look at that, I can't, I literally can't do anything to stop that from happening. Like, it just comes, insta-explodes, and my HP drains. Like, I need to be wearing a freaking... Complete that gun looks really cool. A fire retardant suit. Oh, that reminds me. I saw a, uh... I saw a thing. Yeah, she's gonna throw one soon. Dog meat, knock her over. Knock her over. Go knock her over! Hey. Oh, the the mouse. The, this is the dumbest system I've ever seen. A, a, attack On the raider. feel like you don't understand the concept of what I want you to do, dog meat. And I'm dead again. I'm not dead again because now I'm dead again. <laughs> I might turn the difficulty down because like there's challenging and then there's obnoxious. Like this isn't challenging. This is, man, I certainly hope she doesn't throw a Molotov at me so I insta die. I appreciate what you're doing, dog meat, but I can't hit her in the head because she's wiggling. If you could hold her down for me, though. Stop hitting my dog. Thank you. Still alive? Christ. <laughs> trying to see. Okay. I can't really hit him from here. Now again, I don't mind dying repeatedly. I'm I'm completely okay with dying repeatedly. It's just what I die to. Like the Molotov thing, they insta drain your HP, at least on this difficulty. I realize I'm almost dead, by the way. I don't even know, like, oh, I guess he is right down there. Come on, tough guy. Come on. Yeah, anyways, the Molotov thing is just like, I don't know, it's ridiculous. That's like, the, just, it's so stupid. It is so so stupid. Shit. Lost I don't understand like who working there thought that it was a good idea to say just like, hey, Molotovs on survival, they're gonna just insta kill you. Uh just fair warning. Like like the intern the intern programmed in the damage values for Molotovs. But, like, one of the reasons I want to leave it on this is because it seems like it seems like I'm getting really good loot. Granted, I'm only playing on survival, so I don't know if, uh, if playing on the other difficulties will actually give me better loot or, like, the same type of loot, the same quality. But... Again, I read I read an article somewhere. I don't know how true it is. That could have just blown up and killed me. Um, I don't know how true it is, but it said that the loot actually scaled with the difficulty. Uh, so I'm assuming that means I'll get like 
uh, I have a higher chance to get modded weapons, modded goods, uh, like armor and stuff like that. And so far, I have been getting good stuff. That may not actually change if I lower the difficulty. Honestly, I think Metro, the Metro series 2033 and Last, uh, Last Light, I think they did the best thing for a hardcore mode. And it is, you take more damage, but you also do more damage. But this right here is just kind of like artificial difficulty. Because they just increase everyone's HP and damage output. So, I don't know. It's something that I'm, I'm thinking about. I'm considering it. That is a turret right there. Yeah, I, probably. Because I can't really do anything to the turret. Hmm. Hmm. I actually like running low on ammo. Uh, it, it makes you play a little differently, but... Yeah. I'll find you. Come on. Just peek one more time. That's it. Just one more time. I still gotta figure out what we're gonna do against that turret, or about that turret, rather. I guess we do have the Molotov that I don't have equipped right now. That thing still has so much HP. That's out. This is going to take forever. How much HP are you sitting at, turret? Oh my goodness. Alright, can we? Let's do this. And I'm grabbing these things just because I want to actually try to make my own armor. Uh, I think I've mentioned that a few times. Does this turn all the way around? Yes. Is there like a cable showing me what that's connected to? It was your turret dying, you asshole. Gristle's Terminal. This was the guy we killed in Concord. Caravan. Took down another caravan today. Hell yeah, that makes three in one month. To top it off, Freddy came by with the good news that another caravan is headed our way. Says he spotted some guards, but it's mostly civilians. They even got an old broad dressed like a fortune teller and some joker in a cowboy hat. Gonna ask Jared for more men to take this caravan down. That fucking hat is mine. Okay, so that's, I'm guessing, uh, Preston? Or Garvin, or whatever his name is. Uh, we do have a key that we got from Gristle. This is bullshit. What is? Okay, good. We actually get loot. I'll have to go take uh, the rest of those down. Where'd that little fucker go? You guys have filthy language. Can I go in here? Yes. Yes. Why would you put something locked in a locked storage? Got it. I guess to be fair, safety deposit boxes have locks in there inside of a vault. Um, <laughs> take everything. Take everything. How much? No I don't even know how hide. much room we have. It'll all be over soon. So is that is that everything that's in here? Looks like. Looks like. Alright, uh, so we do have to kill a few more people. I think it's time for a snack. Maybe, uh... I don't know, maybe some fancy lad snack cakes. Let's find the people that we killed down here so we can maybe get some more ammo. I don't know why it's so jerky inside these places. Like, it's not this jerky outside at all. And I mean, if, if there were... Gonna, if there was gonna be any stuttering, you'd think that it would be out there where there's more stuff to load in, but like, as soon as I get close to certain things, it's just like, like that, right there. That looks terrible. Like, what is going on with that? I have a 980 Ti, kids. What's going on with this? You, you, like, I don't understand your game, Bethesda. I don't understand it. Am I being punished because I'm not playing on a peasant box? Maybe. Maybe. 
Hello, door. Elevator. I don't really want an elevator. I'm trying to sneak out a little, sneak around a little bit, not trying to actually sneak up on anyone specifically. But we do know that there are a few people in this general direction. It's a fan. What the hell was that? Oh, hell no! Get up! Get up! That it? Oh, I think he's gonna kill you. Ron Perlman says sit. <laughs> wow, he regens HP fast. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, like, him, him whimpering is terrible, but also, I need these. And you're going to get up on your own. Okay, that's up. They're up, rather. Disappearing Let's get our top. ammo, handcuffs, kinky, but not what we're looking for. Mm. Shotgun is not doing so well for us. Maybe that's like a uh. A uh, warning system. The monkey. Alright, buddy, we're going. We were gonna go upstairs to kill them, but. I don't really know how. How do we get. Did I pass stairs? Kind of okay. We'll go down. Get some. Lucky head. Not lucky. I'm just out of ammo, though. We definitely need a better shotgun, or like we need to, we need to do something about it. Excuse me, buddy. Gotta reload sometime, asshole. Alright. 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 I'm salty enough to go ahead and just use a Molotov. Like, did you see how slowly her HP was going down compared to mine? Please don't. Get out of the way! <laughs> oh my goodness.
This is ridiculous. There's someone still in here? No. I don't want to put anything down. I need it all. I need it all. What can I drop? Probably some of these uh, weapons. Let's drop you and you. They don't even weigh that much. There. Crap. I do not like this at all. You bit his arm off, dog meat. Like, <laughs> why did how how did you do that? First of all, that's like my biggest thing. How did you do that? How was said thing accomplished? And can we do it more in the future? This is just a door. But the person. Oh. Okay. Be on the lookout for trip wires and stuff. They like them. Okay, yeah, there's a... Maybe this is just like a back way and some noisemakers. Those are ghouls. No, I, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to cancel. Oh, it's a turret. That is not the button I hit, but okay. We have fragmentation grenades. Did I not? Oh, I didn't. It's my bad, guys. Ow. Everything in this game hurts so much. Honestly, after this, I'm feeling like I'm going to turn the difficulty down. <laughs> uh, mostly just because I'm not really enjoying it at the moment. Because of how tedious it's getting. And I'm sure you guys understand. Yeah, 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 yeah. We can disarm the chains. Excellent. Hey. carrying too much again. Yes. Right? No, take it. Take it. Take it, take it. Take the telephone, too. Lonnie's terminal. Turret control for whole facility, please. What? I've asked Jared for another turret down here. He says he's working on it, but he... But he ain't convinced, or ain't convinced, he ain't just blowing me off so he can get back to playing with his chems. We need another turret. This pipe access into Lexington has been great for us so far, but if we don't defend it properly, it might as well be an open invitation for anyone looking to get in. Okay. Um. Apparently they killed all the ghouls. Let's see. Killed some more ghouls. Looking at apartments. Gristle and the boys almost got us killed the other day, drinking day drinking down here, making all sorts of noises. A bunch of ghouls didn't want to miss the party and stumbled in through the pipe. So I haven't gotten our other turret down here. Jared needs to get his head out of his ass. He's been pouring way too much time in caps and trying to figure out this sight thing when what we need to be doing is securing this place. I'm going to talk to him. Gristle says I'm just going to make him mad, but someone has to make him see reason. Well, I need to drop some stuff. 
I don't want to drop any junk just because... I don't know, we can turn it into useful stuff, but at the same time... The weapons that I dropped, we can turn into useful stuff. I'll drop the phone. Toy rocket ship. Hold my dreams. The aluminum can, I'm totally keeping though. None of this stuff should weigh anything, right? Overdue book to... Okay, well, fine. That's probably like a quest item. <laughs> Seriously, it probably is a quest item. Uh, purified water. Well, hang on. We'll have some potato crisps, I suppose. Apparel. Um, I probably don't need this many harnesses. So let's drop, like, five of them. Sounds pretty reasonable. Uh, let's drop a leg and an arm. Not in that order. We'll, we'll go from here. We'll continue as or as needed. Uh, so this pipe... That's kind of creepy. Takes us to Lexington, I guess? Is what they're trying to say? I didn't want to do that. Minutemen first rose to prominence in the year 2180 when they defended Diamond City against a horde of super mutant attackers. That reminds me, I saw a tooltip or a, an info an info nugget down there saying that there's a person that can uh, let you change your face. Not that I want to, we're beautiful by the way. But apparently that's going to be an option. Where are we? I'm assuming we're just down in the city somewhere. Which is kind of annoying. I still can't believe how long these load times are. Come on. Can I actually go up this? No. Parent shit. So I'm guessing this way. This is gonna be fun. Get him, buddy. Or don't. That's okay too. She actually stemmed. I hear that turret in there. Comfort grip hair trigger pipe pistol. I don't care. It's a comfort grip hair trigger pipe pistol. I've never had that before. Let's go back in the hallway. Because I hear that turret being grumpy. Okay, fine. I'll drop stuff. I'll drop stuff. I'll drop the gas mask with the goggles. I'll drop the hard hats. And another harness and the farmhand clothes. And some long johns. Because there. Because reasons. Unlock the Kim box. Yep. <laughs> Alrighty. That's it. Take, take everything. Take. Is there anything good back here? It's so jerky back here. Excuse me. Those little spotlights are kind of annoying. So is this back in the main room? Where are we right now? Double doors. Okay, let's go down there, I guess. Yeah, there's the turret. Okay, so we did go through there. It's a generator. Like, this, this spotlight. Is it you? I mean, I, I thought I heard a turret. Maybe I was mistaken. Did we finish? Maybe? Come on. There we go. Uh, 
No, we didn't finish. Well, <laughs> come on. Why are there so many of you, and why are you so well hidden? Like, we go this way. Okay. I'm gonna find you, person. Maybe they're like up and through the other area? Hmm. Is there anything down here? Like anything more I can do? Can I go in there? We've been through this whole section. Alright, I'm gonna go find this guy. I'll be right back. Guys, I think we actually have to go up the elevator. Going down. Lower level. Lower level. Going down. No, I wanted to go up. Main assembly line. This place is huge, and there's someone named Jared with some super creepy mask on. Is there like an actual way up here that I just didn't see? I mean, I'm imagining not. I am still grabbing a bunch of crap, by the way. There's another elevator. Oh my goodness, it was right there. It was literally like I could have just walked up the stairs. Wow. <laughs> I think this is probably going to be the last episode for the evening, folks. I'm going to have to start weaning you guys down on maybe a couple a day or three a day or something like that because i got to get a batch of stuff done for the weekend. I still got to do RimWorld and Timber and Stone for you guys. Uh, so this isn't going to go well, like, at all. I'm just going to go ahead and throw that out there. He's going to be insanely OP, I'm imagining. Um, let's see what we have that might be good though. The bolt action rifle we have no ammo for. The pipe revolver we do have some ammo for. So maybe we use that for a little while instead of Ron Perlman. I feel dirty even, uh, taking Ron Perlman off. So he's up there in his tower. There are at least two people here. That's all I really know. One, one is right there. And I missed. Dog meat. How did that miss? She hit him. It's a turret. It's a turret. How did that miss? So there were at least two, didn't I? I think I said at least two. Uh, let's eat some delicious food. Like a Nuka Cherry. See you up there, friend. I guess I picked a good spot because the turret can't see me. Come on. Jared's down. That leaves a few more down here. And then so many machine gun turrets. And apparently Molotov cocktails. There is actually a, a peak system in this, guys. There's someone over there. Will this car blow up? I'm curious. I mean, it's on fire. That was super satisfying, actually. Uh, so now we just... 
<laughs> we just have a few turrets to, <laughs> to deal with. <laughs> I'm good at making messes, guys. I'm just going to throw that out there. This is super boring. Definitely think I'm going to turn the difficulty down. This isn't worth it. Uh, I had the difficulty all the way up just because I typically like a challenge, but I don't find it challenging. I find it mostly annoying. And, you know, hey, that's that's my personal preference. If you guys are having fun on survival, then by all means, keep on keeping on. Just for me personally, it's like, I don't know. The Molotov thing is just mostly what kills it for me. Can't even hit me from here. These are like the weak versions of what we have in our base, by the way. I think we have the like Mark II or something. I could have blown all this up. Well, I guess if you were trying to sneak, that would definitely hurt it a little bit. Uh, let's see what's going on. Remember, we don't need to take a telephone. Corvega. Hey. Stop it! <laughs> oh my goodness. Go away. You've made some poor decisions in this episode, dog. Safe key. Um, his armor looks kind of cool. Jared? I guess you're using the Raider leathers, but you also have the chest piece. Yeah, that was your chest piece. Alright, so what else you got going on in here, buddy? You got... Stop throwing stuff. Bottle caps. A maximum capacity light pipe sniper rifle. Because, hey. And also there Grognak the Barbarian. You've collected an issue of Grognak the Barbarian. Critical hits with unarmed and melee attacks permanently do plus 5% damage. Nice. Getting shook up over nothing. There's still someone here. Obviously, I mean, he just said something. Uh, weapons... Yes, I mean... Hmm. The damage is terrible. I'm just going to throw that out there. The damage is not good. So we're going to put you there. Um, I'm going to move some stuff around real quick. I'm going to say this maximum capacity automatic. I'm going to put you there. And then Ron Perlman, I'm going to put you there. Because I'm not really going to be doing much melee. Uh, and then I'll drop this guy right here and one of the four shotguns I'm carrying or two of the four shotguns I'm carrying let's check this out Ooh, takes action points to steady it looks super fancy I'm just gonna say that I'll take your mutt fruit your oil can you are so dead. come here buddy It's a semi-auto. Sounded like he said I'm blind. I've done this hundreds of times. Think you'll be any different? For sure. <laughs> As I like drop down and try to be all cool and miss. <laughs> oh my! Did you kill someone else over here? He. I feel like you did. Alright, I guess we killed everyone here. Ooh, a Protectron. Neat. Uh, we didn't look at Jared's computer, so we'll go up there and look at him. Or look at it in a moment, I suppose. Is there any purpose to that room? It doesn't seem like it. I did blow a bunch of stuff up. It was a glorious explosion, by the way. In case any of you were wondering. In case you, I mean, needed me to tell you that it was a glorious explosion. <laughs> Alright. Man, this is a long episode. Alright. Jared's terminal. What do you got to say, Jared? Let's see. Setting up shop, stump, subject, subjects. What's that? It's not the Kims. They're just a trigger for the site. It's me. 
I'm the problem. I wish I had realized it before my arms looked like pincushions. But at least it's a new lead. I need subjects. Uh, she's here. Gristle says there's a caravan headed this way. Some joker. Yeah, we know about that. Uh, fortune teller. It's her. I know it's her. I sent Gristle to collect her. I wonder if she'll recognize me. Of course she will. She saw this coming, after all. Must be talking about Mama Murphy. Uh, turret control. Please choose an option. About your defense system. Turret operations should be limited to trained professionals only. Consumer commands are limited to activation deactivation the turrets hardline to this terminal for all other operations please refer to a licensed technician any tampering will void the warranty yes 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 system diagnostics um two turrets linked offline okay well i guess that's gonna wrap up the episode we'll head outside real quick See where we come out over here. There's that that other turret that we still need to loot that has all that stuff around it. That's near, I guess, like the front of the building or something. Not really sure where it would be. I just know that somewhere there's a turret with a bunch of dead bodies above it that we need access to because we need ammo, like, really, really badly. Neat. quick save oh wow this is like right here so it's across the building or on the other side over there uh, so we'll go grab this stuff real quick and then that'll wrap this episode up in the next episode I'm going to probably be heading back to uh, what's it called sanctuary I guess so we can drop our stuff off There we go. Hopefully that'll replace some of our ammo. Uh, but yeah, we'll head back and we'll uh, dump all of our stuff off. And see about maybe crafting some weapons or like upgrading some weapons and maybe making a little bit of armor as well. Um, the road leather. I'll take the road leathers. Okay. And we'll loot you. Great. All right. That's going to wrap this one up. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Uh, again, this is going to be the last episode for the evening. The rest of them will be starting sometime tomorrow, probably around the same time as when they started today, uh, just depending on when I can get them recorded and uploaded for you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed it. As always, thanks for watching, and have a good one.